My question is to the Premier. Speaker, families in London West are still waiting desperately for autism services for their kids. Virginia is a mom to two children with autism. One of her sons was among the 600 children selected for the OAP core clinical services pilot, but she's not allowed to use the funding that was deposited into her account for the life skills supports her son requires. Meanwhile, her other son, who urgently needs clinical services, is one of almost 50,000 Ontario children forced to wait for needs-based funding. Speaker, when will this government stop ignoring the needs of children with autism and start providing them with the actual services they urgently require? Mr. Children, Community and Social Services. Sure. Thank you, Speaker, and thank you for the, the question to the member opposite. This is, uh, uh, has been an endeavour that our government has been committed to since the beginning of our mandate to address a long-standing neglect of children with autism and their families. And this is exactly why we doubled the funding from $300 million to $600 million. It's why we're implementing a world-leading program that has been created by the autism community for the autism community. This is a program that is comprehensive. It is needs-based. It is family and child center. We've incorporated uh, behavioral therapy, including the ABA. Uh, we've also included mental health, speech language pathology. This is a needs-based program that uses nine domains of need to understand how we best serve the needs Response. of children. So this is something that is going to serve tens of thousands of children. Uh, we are making sure this is rolling out. We are on target, and we are getting the feedback from the 600 children that are now enrolled. Thank you for your question.